Welcome to our day four meditation. Healing fear, awakening peace. Let us begin again with five rounds of Kriya Pranayama breathwork. Inhaling for a five second count, holding the breath for a five second count, and exhaling again for another five second count. Allow this breath work to take you deeper into the present moment, beyond the mind and the body, and into pure awareness. Take a deep breath in, filling up the lungs, and a deep long exhale, emptying everything out. And we inhale for five, four, three, two, one. Holding for five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, five, four, three, two, one. And inhale, five, four, three, two, one. Holding for five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, five. Four, three, two, one. And inhale for five, four, three, two, one. Holding for five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, five, four, three, two, one. And inhale, five, four, three, two, one. Holding for five. Four, three, two, one. Exhale, five, four, three, two, one. And inhale for five, four, three, two, one. Holding for five, four, three, two, one. Exhale, five, four, three, two, one. Course in Miracles says that there is only love and the ignorance of love. Love is reality and the ignorance of love is what we call fear. Therefore, when we feel fear, we are creating a state that does not exist. For only love exists, and love is the awareness of perfect oneness, and the knowledge that there is nothing else. So by meditating daily on the awareness of oneness, we slowly teach the mind that there is nothing to fear, because nothing is separate from us. Once the mind learns that it is safe in this oneness, the effect is what we describe as peace. Sat Chit Ananda Existence, Consciousness, Bliss Oneness Awareness, peace. P. 
Peace is the fragrance of love. It is our natural state. Just as it is the nature of a flower to smell beautiful. And so when the mind is no longer seeing separation, fear becomes impossible. This is not to say that we don't experience fear, because fear is certainly the strongest of all the illusions in the mind. But there is a way to become free from the illusion of fear so that you can live and abide in the peace of your true nature, which is simply a state of mind that holds no fear. Peace is power. A peaceful mind is able to respond instead of react. A peaceful mind is a magnet for solutions and creative ideas. And a peaceful mind is a channel for love in every moment. And so if fear is merely the belief in separation, this belief can be healed within us by transcending duality or the belief in opposites. Consider the way that heat and cold appear to be two separate things. And yet cold is merely the absence of heat. Darkness is only the absence of light. You cannot shine darkness into a room. You can only shine light. There is only one variable in the universe, and that one is love light. The absence of love light is not a separate thing in and of itself. It has no independent existence. Just as cold and darkness have no independent existence apart from heat and light. And once the mind knows this to be true, fear becomes impossible, and the mind experiences everlasting peace. And so I want you to visualize a field of sunflowers on a bright and sunny day. Notice how the mind initially interprets these sunflowers as being separate from one another because they all appear to be in different locations in this field. But from a higher level of awareness, we can begin to see how each sunflower is supported by the soil that it grows in. The soil is supported by the planet, which gives life to all nature on Earth. And this planet is supported by the sun that it orbits, which feeds this planet and all life within it. The sun is supported by the gravity of the Milky Way galaxy, which dances in circles throughout the universe which supports all that exists within space and time. Can any one of these exist separately or in isolation? Do you see anything in the universe that is not a part of this perfect oneness? 
fear is merely the illusion that you are separate or isolated in this universe. And through the awareness of perfect oneness, we can teach the mind that this is impossible. And so I want you now to place all of your attention at the base of your spine in the root chakra. This is the red ray energy center, which responds to the belief in separation with the feeling of fear. When someone is in the state of fear, this energy center creates a barrier of protection through this red ray energy that prevents anything else from entering your energy field. This is why someone who is in fear cannot hear logic or reason until this red ray defense is laid down. Love is the energy that depolarizes fear and teaches the root chakra that it is safe. So I want you now to hold this energy center in love and speak into it our mantra for day four. The peace of God is with me. I am safe. Speak this mantra five times into the root chakra and each time you repeat it, see this energy center flowering open, surrendering to love and feeling totally at peace in the awareness of oneness. Now, I want you to take a deep breath in through the nose and visualize yourself pulling this red ray energy up to the heart center as its color slowly fades into a bright, radiant green, like the colors of Christmas. And see this energetic connection being formed, creating an inseparable bond between these two energy centers that now and forever forward, this root chakra will find its safety and security through the awareness of oneness in the heart. Spend a few moments now enjoying the silence of this awareness of your perfect oneness and feel the love of creation holding you safe eternally in its arms. <laughs> 